Hello, my pretties. How are you guys? Today is Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. Normally, you guys do not see my videos on the day that I do them. Normally, that's not how it goes. Um, but today, that's how it happens. Um, I wanted to tap into the love energy on the day, okay? Um, even though I've done love readings for all elements, um... I wanted to tap into the love energy collectively on the actual day. You understand what I'm saying? Because although you saw them yesterday, I released them yesterday. I did them about a week ago, okay? Like right now as we speak, I got about like five readings um, in my phone for you guys to watch, okay? Because I do a whole bunch of them and then I release them simultaneously. That's how I work, okay? Um... First of all, I had to do this, like, I'm, I'm just going to sum it up because three times there was distractions. One of the times I kind of felt like I really don't want to be putting out this kind of information because I feel like, um, because I feel like I want to protect the information regarding love because that is a part of a lot of people's ten of pentacles. That's a lot, a part of a lot of people's um, divine destiny and their inheritance okay and so i want to protect that speaking of protecting that you guys could go to theprettyoracle.com due to the stuff that i was picking up in the readings i made um i tweaked the love bundle the love clearing bundle i've added protection into the bundle so it's love clearing and protection due to the things that are coming out in the, in, in the readings like the love energy the, the person your person is right there it's right there like you can reach out and touch it for a lot of you guys and um uh, with this information coming out okay first of all and then second of all um with the person being so close and people working against you, it's like, okay, you know, um, let's go ahead and start doing love bundles. Um, that's important. So that's on sale. Okay. What else? Okay. First of all, let's talk about it. One of the reasons why I had to restart the camera is because this energy of sexuality came out. Someone is still figuring themselves out. Let me be honest with y'all. I'm tired of hearing that shit. All right. I'm tired of hearing it. Um, cause once that come out, I know we're speaking about X energies. I know it. And it's just like, eh, triggering, <laughs> but please, please. Okay. I started the camera over. Guess what came out again? First sexuality. God said, um, don't play with me. I said what I said. And I said, this person is ACDC and I want to talk to you about it real quick. Again, 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 <laughs> okay. Um, this particular person may have been um, dealing with um, same sex while you were at work or on their job, okay, while they were at work. Okay, so be mindful of that. But you don't even have to be mindful, mindful of it because I feel like you're not even dealing with that person anymore but i feel like let's tap into that person real quick but i feel like um you have left this person they may be still um being in your energy or whatever the case is um i'm speaking to the to those of you guys that are totally like because then another energy came up where it's like whoever i'm speaking to like, does not want to um, entertain anybody unless they're 100%, like, uh, wanting stability. Like, somebody's not trying to have no fling, no fly-by-night, no ACDC. The only pawns you want them to swim in, swim in is yours. You don't want them to, to, to swim in the pond with Paul and Paula. That's just not what you want, who I'm specifically reading for. It's just not what you want. Um, and this came up in, th this card came up in all of the, uh, element, elemental readings. <sighs> yeah, like I said, but this, now, this justice energy at the bottom of the deck, like, I really do feel like somebody was, 
like my grandmother saying, ACDC. Like, I, that's all I can say. That's all I can say. Show me something about this person. If you're a man, this could have been a woman. You, okay. Somebody got nipple tattoos. Specifically, you know the tattoos that, um, that change, like, the, the, the shape of your nipples like you know your nipple is a is a uh like this round like somebody can have a heart or a star somebody got nipple tattoos oh my gosh show me child i don't even want to know whatever this is is done in the dark and it's done with um if this is a man is done with um transgender transgender is done in the dark that's why I say they still figuring themselves out because I guess they don't want they, I guess they don't want nobody to know whatever the case is but I feel like you know I feel like you know you are not interested in it. Okay, let's move forward. So we have patience. Just a few more months, good things come to those who wait. Okay, what is the good thing? There's somebody that wants to communicate with you. Okay, um, we see date night over here and communicate. So somebody wants to. It says get ready to be wand and don. Show me get ready to be wand and don. Um. Homie, this is definitely when you emotionally heal. Look, Ace of Cups. Definitely when you move on from an emotionally heal from uh, whoever this person was, okay? With this wishy-washy back and forth energy kind of. Um, you will be getting a love offer. Like somebody will be asking you out on a date or something like that. Whoever this person is, now, let's get into this. And this is why I kind of like started it over at one point. Um, or, or, or I rethought about posting it because um of who this person may be so i'm gonna try to um give it to you as simple as possible okay this person may be somebody who works for the justice system um i feel like this individual is very intuitive i feel like um they may be a fire sign um, or a water sign. They're very intuitive. There's something here about like meticulous attention to detail, finding shit out. Okay. Whether, whether they are, um, uh, a reader, a prophet or a cop. You know what I'm saying? Or a detective. It's very, it's, 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 it has to do with legalities. Um, not just legalities, but justice. Okay, um, <laughs> do you mind if I stroke you up? Do you mind if I stroke you down all through the night? Who is that? That's that person, the new person. But anyway, I feel like whoever this person is, they're watching. Another thing that came up was, um, When they come to communicate with you, right? I heard Kelly say, I, I asked, what are they going to say? And I heard Kelly say, or oh, is it Beyonce? I don't know. Baby, I see you working hard. I want to let you know I admire what you do. Didn't know if I need to reassure you. My, lo my life would be purposeless without you. You, ins you challenged me to be better. Inspire me to do better. I don't know. Sit back and let me pour out my love letter. Let me help you take off your shoes. Untie your shoestrings. Take off your cufflinks. What you want to eat, boo? Somebody wants to cater to you. But I feel like that's the second part of the conversation. The first part of the conversation is, okay, down here. Somebody, this person is going to come to you and tell you like that. Karma is a bitch. Somebody is going through... Um, somebody lied on you. 
somebody lied on you it could be a couple and let me tell you something if it's a couple there was a if it's a couple the woman um how you say it she enticed this man to do something do you something on purpose you know one of them dudes that's like just easy to just easy just easy okay that's all i'm gonna say um or this person could be coming to you telling you like i was interested in you somebody told me this that and a third about you i've been um looking at you i've been watching you and that's not really what i'm seeing but then also there's a gift attached to this. You know what I'm saying? There's a gift attached to it. Oh, it could be like this person told me I wanted to bring you an opportunity of some sort. You know what I'm saying? But somebody told me you wasn't shit. Or here's an opportunity of some sort that somebody tried to stop you. I figured it out because it's what I do. I pay attention to detail. And I wanted to come to you and, and, and tell you like this is actually yours. Somebody tried to take it from you um, or they lied on you or somebody tried to stop you from getting this opportunity. But here I am to present this opportunity to you. Another thing too, um, it was something like about like the, the card of talent came out in finding. So somebody feels like they found you and you're talented. Um, but they're also, it kind of feels like they're also looking at you saying like, you're a star. Baby, I see you working hard. I want to let you know I admire what you do. Somebody likes what you do. Or how you do it or some shit like that. Let me pull a couple. I mean, I already did, but I, I just for your viewing pleasure, okay? All right. Show me this. Show me something about this person, okay? Show me something about this person. Sorry for asking y'all again. <laughs> um, it was a lot. It was a lot. It was a lot getting this this out. It was distractions. It was not really sure if I wanted to say anything about it. But that's why, you know, I really feel like you guys go and get the um, bundle, the love bundle. It's on sale, okay? Um, to cleanse, cleanse and protect your love energy, okay? As this is, as this is coming closer. It's coming closer. Okay, that's what I was looking for, this card. Something about online. Something about online. Something about online. Also, um, this came out last time too. Somebody's a Leo. Don't you just love a Leo? <laughs> <laughs> somebody, it's somebody out there saying actually, no, I don't. <laughs> okay. Because they done had a bad Leo in the past. But I like them. I do. They, I like Leo. Show me. Show me something about this person, please. This person may be a Leo. So we have higher self and sacred intuition. I told you. You know, and, and, and this energy of soulful appreciation. This is somebody who like, uh, that's how I just felt. Not sexually either, but also sexually. Because I keep seeing y'all, when this person energy come up, I keep seeing y'all sitting Indian style. I don't know if this person is going to be like, hind practice Hinduism, Indian, or something like that. But I just keep seeing every time, I keep seeing y'all sitting Indian style. Like you straddling this person. And, and, and like stroking and meditating at the same time. Tantric, it's tantric, whatever it is. Anyway, this person is very smart. This person is very smart. I'm pointing to my third eye. Look, and look at her. Like, I, I even feel like you guys may have some sort of telepathic communication going on because I picked this up, you know, in the in the read that I did before this. Like, it, it's very, it, it's it's a it's a uh, yeah. Like this could you this could be soul family to you. You know what I mean? Especially with this energy of soulful look, appreciation, and then love, acceptance, and romance. Like this person uh, wants to help heal your heart. You will help heal theirs. Not that you guys are needing, uh, you know, needy of each other, but you guys could use each other. This is the perfect um, mix. It feels like a um, 
this is a divine couple. You know what I mean? This is a this is a this is a divine couple. There's somebody here who, you know, cherishes their soul over money. Isn't that different? They cherish their soul, their soul, literally, okay, over money. It's more important to them. Okay. I feel like this person is always gracious. Um, I feel like they're very spiritual and in tune with things. I feel like they, this, the, from what I've been picking up from this person, they're in more in tune with you than you think. And I don't know why, but it feels to me like it's because they've been watching you and because they are intuitive, they may have asked. Because I've been getting this person that may have been doing readings on you or getting readings on you or just tapping in because it says higher self or sacred intuition. This person has sacred intuition. And it's like they know something about you that you may not know. You know what I'm saying? As far as like who, who you are to them. Like, okay, for example, yeah, like I said, this person's going to um, uh, help you with a lot of healing and, and vice versa. This is one of them. This is one of them, them things where it's reciprocity. I'm sorry, y'all. My neck hurt. It's one of them things where it's like reciprocity. But anyway, what was I going to say? That just threw me off. Yeah, this is somebody that's going to feed your spirit. Oh, I was going to say, right, imagine you read cards or something like that. Or, you know, you 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 have sacred intuition. Imagine you, being, you, you, you stumble across somebody, right, whether they on a platform, whether you... It doesn't matter how you stumbled on them. But I've been seeing, you know, um, that whoever they looking at is viewable, okay? Viewable on whatever network or they can see them, okay? Um... And like, let's just say you go tap in, you go, you start watching my readings or anybody else's readings, or you get a reader from me or you get a reading from anybody else, or you do your own reading, or you do a reading on a person or whatever, and you have a dream about this person and you're like, this is my person. Oh shit, this is my person. But then it's like, you got to come in and talk to that person for whatever reason. Let's just say it's time to talk to this person, time to communicate. You feel like it is, but they communicate up here for whatever reason. Like I said, this person comes they 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 know you in some way they got some shit to tell you otherwise but also it's like how do i invite this person out on a date when i know they're my person i can't be coming to them like um yeah such and such was lying on you and you know blah blah blah, blah. also will you marry me <laughs> mike i'll give you a couple minutes to think about it but we belong together god said it and it's like mm, Okay. I feel like this is how this person feel. Like it, it's things that they know about you. They checked. What do they know about the collective? Let's find out. I asked this already in the element reads, but let's go ahead and do it collectively on the day of. Okay. On the day of. Shit. I feel like. Ain't nothing wrong with it repeating it. They just told me that this person may be a talent scout. I just saw the card for that while I was shuffling. And I and I remember earlier I saw finding, finding um talent. I'm channeling something, y'all. They saying like somebody may have been looking for you. And call the wrong number or something like that. I don't know why somebody else's number, but was on whatever. And like they called, and the person was talking cold cash shit about you. But also saying like I, I don't know. Um, I just picked that up. Wrong number. The wrong number. They called the wrong the wrong number. Hold on. What is that that I'm picking up on? Look, justice. 
I somebody could have lied on a contract or on on a on a document or something like that. Show me. <sighs> What's this for swords? What's this for swords? told another person you was crazy <laughs> like you, you you needed healing you needed healing um something about somebody saying something about the doctor like or your health or something like that it's something here and it's like it's something here that got to do with the wrong number or somebody putting a number down you know, possibly, like, if it was yours and then they reached somebody who started to tell... This is not for everybody, y'all. This is for somebody specific. If it click, it click, okay? I don't want everybody to take that and run with it. Yeah, like, so, child, let's move on. Because we... I, because we have already explored that. Remember, like, whoever, somebody is weird. And they're going to get found out for their lies, okay? But let's go back to, what, what, what were we asking? I wish I was live so y'all can tell me. Um, what are they viewing? What are they viewing about you or how are they viewing you? Show me, please. And, and, and when I asked this last time, it came up kind of spiritual. Oh, it is. It's giving, um, show me. How are they viewing you? Joy, blessings, intuition. So they're 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 looking at you as if you're smart. They're looking at you as if you're making the best of the situation. They're looking at you as if you're chilling. You're you're um you're being pushed forward and you're going with the flow is what it feel like. They look at you as somebody with compassion. They do look at you as somebody that is is healing. Baby, I see you working hard. Want to let you know I'm proud. Want to let you know I admire what you do. I also feel like you could have helped this person in a way, depending on what you do with your artistry. Show me what. Somebody sees that you're blessed. They may have something to give you. This person may have something to give you. Okay, let's find out. Let's pull a, a few cards. Let's find out about this person's. Uh, personal life, something that may be going on in this person's personal life. Damn. When I tell you, it, it's been, it's, it was so much getting this reading out. Like, it's the, to the point where I was like, if it ain't meant to be, it ain't meant to be. Um, this car just um flipped over sooner than you expect also i would like to thank michelle for getting me those cards i really appreciate it um i just got them i really appreciate it i had asked for a few things off of my amazon wish list and i think like three people like really came through that's jamil Cicely and Michelle and I love y'all thank you so much I got the things that I needed y'all which was these remember I said I needed to um yeah so I kind of like reorganized and stuff like that um very appreciative show me about this person so Destiny's at the bottom of the day show me about this person's um personal life who we tapping into please 
tell us their business since they know her. I mean, it's only fair. It's only right. New love. New person or unknown person. That's what it feel like. Child. Twin flame. God damn. Mature man. Let me see. And passion. I was just about to say something sexual. Let me tell y'all something. First of all, I hope this man is just mature and he ain't that old. Because the way that I see y'all climbing this tree. <laughs> my back, my back. I, you know what I'm saying? It, but it's both of y'all though. That's how I know whoever this person is. They got to be like physically fit or something like that. Whoever this person is, they can pick you up. Because I see them every time they've come up. They come up with like big bleep energy and then also like tantric sex like the kind of sex that you can have for a long time and and and, and it's very passionate but then also um this is like swinging from chandeliers type energy oh they're saying that, uh, oh yeah tantric sex is they're saying that's what okay <laughs> It gives you energy rather than um, takes from you. This person will give you energy rather than take from you. You know what I'm saying? Um, okay. So, they not telling me too much about this person's personal life. They just say, oh, the male, mature in age. They stay in new love, twin flame. This person has, show me passion. You guys are going to have a lot of chemistry. Look, the nine of cups. You guys are going to have a lot of chemistry. Um, you know, um... <laughs> Um, you know, th this person is coming is coming in is what it feel like. You guys may like to drink together from time to time. Um, this person views you as beautiful. That's why there's going to be a lot of passion. Like, that's why you guys not going to be able to keep your hands off of, of each other. Like, this person views you as beautiful. Look, Ten of Cups. Come on now. This is kind of crazy. This is, like, everything that you could have ever dreamed of. Like, I feel, and that's another reason why I didn't want to really, like, I started over as well. Like, I feel like I'm up here, like, selling dreams. <laughs> Damn. You understand what I'm saying? It's that good. It's that good. It's that good. Um, and I spoke to y'all about this um, energy in one of the elemental reads. Like, when something is, like, too good to be true. Um, and you, and you treat it as such, like, don't go stressing this, this, this older, mature male out. Okay. Cause you not sure about him or whatever the case is. Don't be letting, let me see your phone. Don't be doing none of that weird shit. Okay. <laughs> don't do it y'all. But yeah, it does. It feels like something that's like way, like way too good, like way too good, you know. And and, and you deserve it, and you deserve it. And this is what people was fighting you for. Okay, show me. It's something about. I, well, I'm hearing. Um, in the middle of the night oh, when my body's feeling for you, baby. Gotta call you up and let you know just what I'm feeling, baby. 9110024. Baby, it's an emergency. I'm call I, what if his name is Gerald, y'all? That's Gerald. Levert Sweat Gill. Gerald Levert. Keith. Is it Johnny Gill? Whoever this person is, they may have like a very common name. I keep picking that up about them too. Somebody, this person could be work for the justice system. Like this justice, oh, this could be a Libra. Like they just keep coming in. Um, so, you know, like basically bringing in the energy of justice. Like, and, and it's like with the, with the eight of wands and the chariot and the ace of cups, it's like this person is coming towards you. My body all over your body, babe. You know what I'm getting? Like, there's such a strong magnetic attraction here that, like, you guys could kind of be, like, trying to avoid, like, avoid it. 
But like I'm getting like a phone call, like in the mid, like you know, it was late in the middle of the night when my body's feeling for you, baby. Gotta call you up, just let you know just what I'm feeling, baby. <laughs> Nine one one zero zero twenty four. Baby, it's an emergency. I'm calling and I ain't got no drawers. How would you like it if I lay? <laughs> All right, y'all. Yeah. Um. Mm, 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 mm. You have to wear a lot of protection. It's it's very devil card, not in a bad way, but like a lot of uh, like uh, insatiable amounts. Is that what they say? Like like a lot, a lot of sex, like a lot. Show me this passionate energy. Show it to me. Like it's just like. Eight of Swords. Look, it's like it's all that you can think about. Like, it's, it's all in my head. I think about it over and over again. It's that. It's like, oh, it's like constant. And then, and then, um, uh, somebody breaks. Like, this is after y'all already know each other is what it feel like. Somebody breaks. Like, yo, like, like, I gotta have you, like, right now, please. And, and whoever else feel the same way. Somebody else feels the same way. You guys feel the same way about each other. Show me this mature male. So anything we can know about her. This person don't like the way you was treated is what I'm hearing. Show me. pentacles though i see i see like this person is like on their way to you or some shit like that there's some admiration here that they want to tell you about we don't know but what's the three of pentacles what's the three of pentacles i don't know this person could be saying like three of pentacles the king of wands this person could be saying like they could be a leader of something or um in charge of some shit like that and it could be like i i want to work with you I want to work with you. Let me make sure. Let me see what that is. What is that? Show me. What, what is that? King of Wands. What is that? Um. Yeah, like I have an opportunity for you. Like I have an opportunity for you. Now, I told y'all before, you see this energy of reconciliation? It's like somebody comes bearing gifts. Something that you thought you missed out on or something like that. Or something that you thought wasn't going to happen for you or whatever. And, 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 and also this person want to provide assistance to you. Like this can have to do, this whatever this is can have to do with you grieving. It could be even connected to a death or something like that. Or a bad time in life that this person know you was going through. People treating you a certain way after this. Listen. Um, it's kind of strange, but I'm gonna just tell you like this: this person got you pegged. This person got you pegged. They feel like they know you, and they had to go looking for you for some reason. Like it's something here where it's like they had to come check for you for whatever reason, and it's connected to your life. Something you going through. It's connected to something you're going through. Self-acceptance, compassion, and forgiveness. Like, this person feels sorry for you. <laughs> Not like that, but, yeah, like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, like, moving on and letting go. Like, they feel bad for you. You know what I mean? And they want to come in and, like, empower you is what it feels like. And, 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 and that's going to be by giving you some sort of opportunity or something like that. Okay, I'm trying to grasp it as much as I can. All right? Let me see. We're going to clarify this justice energy and then I'm going to go ahead. Show me this justice energy, please. Five of Pentacles. Yeah. This is, this is going to be some sort of truth, clarity, what you deserve. You know what I'm saying? This is what this person is coming in to do. 
because you could be in a situation where you lack something or somebody trying to take something from you or whatever the case is. This come this person is coming in to restore balance. Again, I told y'all, this seemed like a cop. And then like, or, or something, okay? Law enforcement or something. That's all I'm going to say for some of y'all. And it's like, you will understand why this person knows about you. But if, if they work in that type of field, you understand? And knowing your business. But then also, but then also, I told y'all, whoever this person is, they're tapped in. Show me that. Um, this person. Knight of Swords. This is a person who, who, who thinks on their feet. This is the person who thinks on their feet. But then Knight of Swords is also, also a cop. Uh, some shit. Like the page of swords can even be like a detective or something, something like that. Yeah, knight of swords, seven of swords. Show me. This can even be like something like undercover, a uh, undercover or something. Look, page of swords. I just told y'all. I just told y'all. I'm calling it out. This could be like an undercover somebody or something. I feel like their job has to do with collecting information, figuring shit out. Yeah, look at this. They go to um. The emperor here. Emperor and the king of pentacles. That's how he been coming out a lot. A lot. He just recently started to come out as the king of swords. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like it has to do... Why he coming out the, as the king of swords a lot has to do with him assessing you. Like figuring shit out about you. Show me date night over here, please. Get ready to be wand and don. Get ready to be wand and don. This person has made up their mind about you. Yeah. With the with the ace of wands, it's like... um, <laughs> Do you like my wand? Please check yes or no. Check yes. Okay? You guys check yes. You're going to be defensive. You're going to be defensive. Look, here he coming. I told y'all, King of Swords. He's been coming out as the King of Swords lately. Like, he's going to, like, you know, this this reach out is, is going to, like I said, it's going to be about whatever this shitty situation is about that you're grieving about. But then also, it's, like, going to be like he, he blowing you kisses. You know what I'm saying? Be nice. Be nice. This is not something that you would want to pass up. Remember I said... Nine of cups, ten of cups, ten points. Remember, I said that. Oh, okay. Show me. Let's close it up. Show me, please. This man may have. <laughs> I'm sorry. This man may have a salt and pepper beard. Or like a all white beard like Santa Claus. Y'all, let me tell you why I'm laughing. Let me tell you why I'm laughing. Because the kind of sex that I see y'all having, I just I'm hearing, can you keep up? Baby boy, baby love my friend. Something about Beyonce and them, Kelly and them. Destiny Child. Oh, Destiny. This is Destiny. Ooh. I put it right there, made it easy for you to get to. Now you want to act like you don't know what to do. Can you keep up? I'm just wondering. But it seemed like he could. And that's what tickles me. Because it's like, oh. <laughs> oh, okay. You know? I'll be like, like, like he been lifting weights and shit. I don't know. I'm telling you right now. Somebody know what they doing, and they can do it for a long time. They equipped. Show me. What did I say? Sexuality. I just said this. In the divine feminine, like, ooh. Ooh. Lord have mercy. <laughs> Child. This is the type of person that like. I'm sorry because I felt it. But this is the type of person that like. Uh, you know. You know how when like. 
it's the type of person that'll pleasure you in different places at the same time. You want to see what I'm saying? So, like, if he if he in the middle, you know what I'm saying, he going to make sure he reach up and, like, grab you up top. Or, like I said, pleasure into different parts of your body at the same time. Who the hell is this? <laughs> because, and I say that because this person is, like, very well-rounded. No, come on, y'all, because let's be honest, like, let's be honest, you know, sometimes when you, um, have somebody that checks, you know, all the other boxes, they bad in the bedroom, or they don't do it for you in the bedroom, and then the ones that check all the boxes in the bedroom don't check, man, not another box ever in life, you understand what I'm saying? And so, it's, um, it's very amazing, you know, not that this person won't have any shortcomings, but they won't show up as shortcomings to you, because I feel like you are going to be very into this person, like, the way they treat you, you know, um, every time I tap into this, I pick up something new and different about this person, um, and, and it's just amazing, you know, so I don't want to say shortcomings, but nobody's perfect, nobody's going to be the, the perfect person for you. But this is the perfect person for you. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You tell me. Like, like you're just this person is going to um tickle all of your fancies. Like they're going to um stimulate you in so many different ways, child. And you're worth this. Like, uh, some of you guys may be feeling like, look, we have the sacred woman. Some of you guys may be feeling like, like, damn, like. Damn, um, I'm hearing um, Sade, the sweetest taboo. If I tell you, if I tell you now, would you keep on, would you keep on loving me? If I tell you, if I tell you how I feel. Like some of you guys may feel like you a little damaged. And, you know, this man may not speak a lot about his past or whatever the case is. You may think that you too damaged for this person or something like that or you may feel like you have shortcomings and, and it's just like um too good for me that's what Sade says she says every day is Christmas and every night is New Year's Eve every day is Christmas and every night is New Year's Eve like you gonna be kind of feeling like oh my god like this is too this is too good to be true anyway with that feeling um don't mess that up you deserve it okay don't start second guessing yourself as far as do you deserve this you do i don't know it's something about this man he don't talk a lot but i feel like that's okay i i feel like y'all read each other minds he already feel like he know your he know your stuff <laughs> he know your stuff there's a quiet storm, and I never... Oh, this it, it's a quiet storm. And I never felt like this before. It's a quiet storm, and it's you. Ha -ha. It's a quiet storm, and it's you. So this person is a very serious individual, too. Like, you know, it's kind of like... This person is kind of like no nonsense, but I feel like they're willing to allow you to um, hit them in their feels. They watched you. They feel like you've earned it. So, well, happy Valentine's Day, and I hope this helps you guys.